Hi there, welcome to Daily Monster 65. I really like today's character. I like that it's not a humanoid character, and it doesn't conform to any particular animal either. It's its very own thing. And it flows directly from the motion of the ink, which is always really satisfying to see, for me anyway. I immediately notice this sort of leaping motion with the tail that almost serves as a comic book speed line. And then the head isn't a bird, isn't a mammal, isn't any of the shapes that I've done before in this series. It's got a little bit of an orca vibe in the coloration. And at the same time, it's super excited. What's going on here? What is the name of this species, first of all? Some sort of killer whale frog hybrid. And one shudders to contemplate what dating situation led to that. But that's possibly beside the point. And usually I leave these things open-ended, as you know. And I don't place anything outside the drawing that suggests what the monster is interested in. But this one so eagerly jumped at something that I didn't want it to just jump at nothing. And so I thought, maybe it eats the ink that fuels it and makes it be in existence and makes it grow, possibly. But I thought, well, maybe it's really interested in this ink jar. And it took me a little while to place it correctly. I'm sorry. I'm doing it upside down. Please leave me a story in the comments. Thank you so much for being here, and I'll see you again tomorrow.